Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm painting Venice City. So I pick up the brick buildings, the canal, gondolas, and I don't forget to compose the light coming from the right hand side corner. So the buildings on the left hand side will be very light and the right hand side buildings are dark. Using a 5B pencil I sketch uh, the city and I sketch everything and um, make them very lovely. So please enjoy and uh, join me to um, pen this painting step by step. Firstly, I put uh, some color to warm up the painting. I think this painting is a very uh, warm and use a lot of warm color. The yellow ochre and uh, the red and orange for the buildings and a little bit uh, cool color for the canal for the water the paper is still wet I put uh, some strong color for the flowers on the balcony so they can plant uh, together naturally I wet the canal area by using a little bit cool color the lavender and um, ultramarine blue I use a uh, wet on wet technique to paint the shadow on the canal For the buildings on the background, I use lighter color, but I don't forget to paint the shadows because uh, of the light coming from the right hand side. As I said, the building on the right hand side are dark, so I use the bone color for these buildings. I use the yellow ochre and burnt sienna, mixing with a little bit red. By the way, I paint the. Um, gondola as well so the water can mix together because the bank and uh, the gondola is um, shredded by the right hand side building so uh, it's very dark as well the shadows of the gondolas uh, is also very dark so use a strong color Now I pen the shadows of the left hand side balcony and I design a canopy underneath of the balcony. So the canopy 
has a its shadow on the left hand side buildings um, on the wall it's a very strong color a lot of uh, pigment for the windows I use very um, strong um, color um, as well um, because uh, um, it in indicates the um, shadow um, of uh, the windows and also the color of uh, the window as well now I pan the second gondola in a distance because uh, it's so um, it's far away we just uh, indicate it by painting the shaft of uh, the gondola not in many details I use a lot of water mixing with the color to paint the re reflection of uh, the buildings on the canal So the more you mix the uh, color with uh, the water, um, the easier for them to blend together, and it makes uh, the building, um, sorry, to make the painting lovely and um, naturally. I think painting like telling a story but uh, using color, using composition, the um, um, technique uh, and um, um, the um, patient uh, to show everything, to show the city. Uh, because, uh, we can tell um, by um, the story by um, by words or by text, but uh, just the uh, colors, just uh, indication. Um, that uh, what we want to tell the audience about the uh, um, landscape, about the city. For the background building, I uh, use the right brush uh, to pan the windows, just indicate them on the wall. The dry brush truck, now um, I use a very useful one to um, show the windows, and show the molding and the object um, that uh, need to be highlighted on the painting. I put some people on in the gondola. So the blue color on the gondola can make the contrast um, with the uh, the other warm color from the buildings now I highlight uh, some area that receive the light I use the white color from the tube to make sure it uh, can pop up
I think the focal point here um, around the front gondola and the eye can move up to the canopy and balcony of the left hand side building. Now I put some black underneath of the left hand side buildings and underneath of the gondola to um, highlight them. It's time to correct uh, the details of um, the windows and the poles. And make sure everything is uh, very good. Now I can peel up the uh, tabs and the painting is done. Uh, I hope you enjoy this painting as much as I do. Um, the other thing is um, I need to uh, put some reflection of uh, people to the canal. Thank you very much for your watching. Please share and subscribe this video. See you in the next video. Bye bye.